the senses are very important to me about designing the garden. And I have to think about what kinds of plants have I, I have to have everywhere, and that's lemon verbena, because you can cut it out and put it into ice water and it's just so fabulous. Um, that the, the sense of smell, I think, is really more about the weather. It's more about the type of plant materials that are in a garden. Um, and you have to get up close to things if you really want to determine a fragrance or to enjoy something uh, like ver lemon verbena. When you take, it just looks like a rangy weed, but if you know to crush the leaves between your hands and to have a fragrance like that, it's just wonderful just knowing about it. And of course, everybody likes to touch things, especially take a look at the ligularia. Look at the shine of the ligularia. Look at the size. It's as big as this person's head, one leaf, and it's rounded and it's very smooth and it reflects the light. It has an incredible touch, visual touch, if that's possible. A visual touch, you touch it with your eyes, right? Interesting. Uh, same thing about Podocarpus and about sycamores. Sycamores are a native tree, but they can give people a terrible allergy because of the fine dust and rust that's on the underside of the leaves can have people who are allergic to sycamores sneezing and coughing all day. And taste, it, it reminds, you know, like of the Garden of Eden and going in and eating that fruit and paying the consequences and appreciating that too. So I think uh, come to your senses is what I say. As a landscape architect, you can determine exactly what happens in the design of laying out a walking path, a circumambulatory path that will take you circulating around something and not even going in there or penetrating inside. The idea of moving through space and experiencing all of the senses is part of what life is about and the joy of living with a garden, really, isn't it? To look forward to that fragrance, to look at forward to the, the delight of the color of the roses in the rose garden, or the citrus trees when they're in bloom in the spring. You could smell it a mile away and then you, you, you come to your senses. 